안녕하세요. 제 이름은 나미입니다. Hi, it's Nami, and today I want to sit down and give you a life update because it's been quite a hot minute since I've last had a life update, and there are a number of things I want to talk about. The last update that I gave it was about cutting back on YouTube because I was having this full-time position at my beauty college that I work at, and I was still trying to create content on YouTube full-time as well. So that was very difficult because you cannot have two full times at the same time, and also have kids full time. So I was definitely affected by all the stress, not of teaching, but of teaching at the same time of doing YouTube full time at the same time of trying to raise the kids, which, like Michael, had to do instead of me because it was just way wild. So I have since February stepped down from that position. I did. People say like. You quit a job, but I'm still teaching there at the beauty college. I'm just back to the previous certificate position that I had been teaching in the past before I was promoted to diploma programs. I've stepped down from diploma programs now. Am completely focusing on YouTube full time, in which you may have noticed an increase in uploads since February. Um, we are trying to upload across both of our channels, this one and our family channel right up here. That has also been kind of wild, but also very fun. But yeah, I think YouTube is something that we couldn't really do part time, and because we needed to focus completely on it, we did want to have that as our sole time investment. Also, there has been a shift in our family dynamic. There is not a third baby yet. I'll talk about that a little bit later throughout this video, but there has been a shift in our family that we cannot mention yet. There will be a video announcing it very soon. But shortly after we got our second car, we did decide to donate our first one, which we actually had donated to us. Our deep thanks to the Sai family who has provided that donation and really helped us during a very difficult time. We are so thankful to be able to. Now, also donate and pass on that vehicle as well. So please watch out for the announcement video of regarding our family. If you are a Nacho fan for a while, or if you are a new Nacho fan who has been binge watching our content, you will know that I have a lot of like things about my family that has happened and is still going on. If you don't know what I'm talking about, you may be able to find some videos in this playlist that might help make things. Make more sense. But moving on to the next topic, which I did talk a little bit about just a few seconds ago, <laughs> in regards to a third baby, I get asked a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, like every single live stream, often in comments and a lot of like messages and DMs about a third baby. I don't think we've actually given like an official statement on our plans for our family, but for now we are deciding to wait until our third child. We did initially want a big family, but because both Galahad and Zeke were delivered through C-section, Galahad being an emergency C-section after a failed induction, and Zeke's being an elective C-section after a failed VBAC, we do want to make sure that we are a little bit more financially stable to be able to hire. A nanny or a caregiver after labor and delivery that can help with the kids, with the house, with food and cooking while I recover. Because if we do have a third child, it will have to be C-section, as you cannot have a natural birth after two C-sections due to the possibility of a uterine rupture, which is when your uterus explodes. <laughs> We do not want that to happen, so we're thinking maybe like two, three years is a good mark to start trying again, or start evaluating if we would like to start trying again for a third child. But before then, we are probably going to wait and work on saving up and also paying our student loans. There is a possibility that we may not even deliver a third child. We have been. Considering and thinking about and praying about adoption as well as one of our options, just because there's so many children out there who don't have parents. If we're able to take one of them, that would be different from if we didn't adopt them. Then I think that could be. Hi, Galahad. So that is something that we did want to think about as well. With an update with Michael's. Happenings. Almost done his third undergraduate program. He's working on his fourth, and he's just letting me know because I don't know these things. I don't know numbers, okay? 
Even one, two, three, or four. I don't know. Canadian. He's also helping with the channels and being my producer, manager, assistant, video, extra editor, and stuff. So that's up with him. In regards to our family vlogs, because a lot of you were saying that you miss our family content and you miss seeing the kids and you miss our family vlogs. They are all up on our family channel, which we have just opened this year. So if you'd like to see more of the kids, Usually we'll post content on the kids on that channel. Do we have any YouTube updates? We're opening merch this month. We're still finalizing details, but I do have one design and two placements for that design ready. We're just waiting on some small details, but hope to open this month and have lots of fun stuff out for you. Galhad is finishing up his first year of kindergarten, of school ever. How does that make you feel? You're gonna be done school soon. Yeah, I know, cause for the other day, SKs will go, and for the other day, JKs will go. That means me. That's right. Galahad, how's it feel? Your first year of school you finished. Is it very different than staying at home with yeah. mom? Remember when you stayed at home every day with mom? Yeah, cause I was very sick. Well, remember when you were a baby last year? You stayed at home with me? Why? And then you went to daycare? Because you're a baby. Do you remember when you were a baby? Oh, yeah. <sighs> Zeke is also in daycare right now. And he is going to be in daycare for a little bit until he is four. And then when he's four, he'll join kindergarten and join school like Galahad. Just a quick poll. Please let me know what kind of content you like the best so that we can focus some of our videos to you right up here in this poll. That'll really help us out. Thank you. I'll see you next time. Bye. A package from Iris Beauty. Perfecting eyebrow brush. A pencil, gray. The packaging is so beautiful. Pure brown essentials. Wow, it's so, they're almost like translucent, but really light. I'm so excited. This one is an emerald green. Also very light and pretty. I'm so excited to try them. Thank you, Iris Beauty. This one's from Cheyenne in PA. I watch your videos every day. Oh my gosh. <sighs> Thank you so much, Cheyenne, for watching our videos. It really means a lot to us. I hope to be a good mother like you when I'm older. I love your videos so much. Please keep posting. Lots of love from Pennsylvania. I don't know if I'm a good mother, but I... We all try. I am definitely so thankful if our videos can be a form of encouragement to you. So thank you for taking your time to watch them. Just a quick note that before we open merch, we are replying to every letter and package that we do receive with a little note and a Nacho Fan bracelet and some stickers. I also like to throw in Galahad and Zeke's art in those replies as well. But once we open merch, we're thinking of discontinuing that just to focus more on featuring your mail on our videos and also being able to send out more in our merch parcels. So definitely feel free to send us anything if you'd like us to reply before merch is open. Bye.